So what you want to do is you get a little speed going, and then you start hitting. Hello everyone, this is Victory Gaming, back with more 7 Days to Die a tutorial video on the vehicles in the game. This is for Alpha 18.4. So we have the bicycle. You have to just have int 1 and buy it with 1 point. And then you have the mini bike, which takes intellect of 4. Uh, the motorcycle now takes intellect level 6. The 4x4 truck takes intellect level 8. And the gyrocopter takes intellect level 10. So they removed the level walls, but obviously you're still going to have to gain some levels to buy these perks. I got all the vehicles laid out here. I got the bicycle, and then the mini bike, the motorcycle. The 4x4 truck and the gyrocopter. So these all have different amounts of storage. And the bicycle is the only thing that doesn't require gas. But the storage space is just one row of nine. Uh, the mini bike is three rows of nine. The motorcycle is four rows of nine. And then you get to the four by four truck, a nine by nine. And what does that equal class? That's 81, 81 spots. But when you get to the gyrocopter, it's a little bit less. It's five rows of nine which is 45. So, because it's such a small little thing here, I guess. So, I usually skip out on the mini bike. It's not like it used to be. It doesn't take all those different parts anymore. Let's look at my inventory. I have all the stuff you need to combine, besides the wheels. So when you craft this, you'll get a handlebar made and you'll get a chassis made. As long as you have any schematic learned or grease monkey perk, you will be able to craft the wheel. So you get, you find the schematic books in the world or buy them from the vendors if you're lucky enough. Or you can actually buy the entire vehicles now from the vendors. And it's very expensive so like if you find a truck chassis in the world and then you can buy the accessory part from the vendor you can then combine it at a workbench and create the entire vehicle with uh, with the 4 by 4 truck it would take four wheels and then we have the gyrocopter it's its own little beast of a thing with the controls versus the other because it flies. So what you want to do is you get a little speed going and then you start hitting spacebar. You'll start going a little bit up. Your nose will go up so you want to hit C when you feel like you want to level off. You know, take some practice. You'll get used to it. You still turn with A and D hold the W to keep the speed going because if you let go you will just fall or land however you want to put it so I'm gonna hit this it's not really gonna hurt me or anything so I landed no big deal just remember don't hit E when you're way up in the air flying <laughs> I'm sure a few people have done that so uh, that'll do it for this video this is just an update from my other video now that we're in alpha 18.4 looking forward to alpha 19 to see what else they come up with enjoy making these videos thanks for watching if you enjoy this video please subscribe and like that really helps me out a lot and i'll see you in the next one hopefully